I am so sorry for not physically remaining in your lives. I am with Autumn. Those are the final words in a letter prosecutors say Robert Ferrante wrote to his family in May of last year, almost a month after investigators say he used cyanide to poison and kill his wife, Dr. Autumn Klein. I think the prosecution's obviously going to try to use these letters to demonstrate that he had a, a guilty conscience. These five apparent suicide letters were never sent. In fact, the detective testified today she found them in a shredder at Ferrante's home. And she, along with other investigators, had to go through hundreds of these scraps of paper to reassemble the letters piece by piece. In one letter, he denied being involved in his wife's death, writing, quote, While I remain steadfastly adamant that I did not take Autumn's life, I no longer have the strength to carry the weight of losing her, someone who shared all the pleasantries and meaningful events, especially with Siana, with the added suspicion that I would be the cause. Ferrante wiped away tears in court as the detective read a letter addressed to his youngest daughter, Siana. He wrote, I can't imagine losing both loving parents at such an early age. Jurors also heard from Klein's mother, Lois, seen here in a blue shirt and brown sweater. She testified that when she was at Ferrante's home, he came in the front door and didn't see me. He looked fine, and when he saw me, he started faking, trying to make like he was teary-eyed and crying.